So let's go ahead and set up a Roku device for the first time. Okay, so this is basically a tutorial on how to set up a Roku TV. I'm using the a device. I'm using a Roku Express 4K Plus connected to a monitor, but it should be more or less the same instructions for any Roku TV. So after pairing your remote to your TV, and if you don't know how to pair, I'll link a video down below where you can see how to pair your Roku remote to your TV. After pairing, select language. So I'm going to go for English. And then once I select language, it's going to automatically start scanning for available Wi-Fi networks. So those are the available ones. Connect to your Wi-Fi network. So select it and enter the password. Okay, now you're going to use your remote to scroll and enter the password. And then select connect. So once you're connected, it's going to check for an update and now on this next screen, it's going to try and set up your Roku remote to control your TV. Okay. Now press continue, select your TV brand. like that and then please point your Roku remote at this TV is music playing select yes then it's going to ask you do you still hear the music select no okay and that should be a success now you should actually listen for music on your TV I'm just uh, speeding through this process because I'm using a monitor and not a TV so make sure you select your specific TV and listen for those sounds and give the appropriate answer to be able to set up your remote to control your TV. Once you go through that, you should see success. Press OK. Now go ahead and sign in with your Roku account. Now for me, the easiest way to do this is to go to uh, activate with QR code. Select that. Now that's going to generate a QR code on your screen, which you can scan with your phone and then use your phone to sign in. Okay or sign up. So here's our QR code. Here's my phone. I'm just going to quickly scan that QR code. And it should take me to the Roku website where I can either sign in or sign up. Okay. Now it's going to take me straight to the sign up page. Let's create uh, your new Roku device. Let's activate your new Roku device by creating an account. Now, if you don't have an account, you can just proceed to create one. Since I already have an account, I'll press existing customer. Okay. And then I'll sign in with my Roku credentials. And sign in just like that. Then it's going to ask me to name my device and select which room I want to locate it. I'll just put it in the living room. I'll leave my uh, default device name as it is and press continue oh sorry I have to agree to terms of service and before I press continue then it's going to take you through some kind of interview do you pay for cable or satellite TV I'll select no then do you currently subscribe to any of these services? I'm just going to select a few and press continue uh, choose some uh, interests sports uh, let's look at kids family education and press continue and that's it basically okay so you can now tap on continue and your Roku TV should start setting up Okay, there you go. So it says updating channels. So now you can just put your phone away and allow your Roku TV to set up using the options you selected.
so when it's done you can just now press the home button to go home now of course the getting started menu will appear trying to guide you on how to use roku just press the home button to go to the home screen okay and there is your roku home page thanks for watching leave your comments and questions down below and good luck